Hey, good day to each and every one of you. Matt from William Henry coming at you with another installment of our ongoing series of A Peek Behind the Curtain at the William Henry Studio. And for this installment, um, I want to talk about one of my very first designs that is still a core part of the William Henry collection. So, 1997, I was relatively a kid, none of this gray stubble, none of these wrinkles, and uh, I started William Henry and I was designing the original collection. One of my first four designs that I actually decided to move forward with was the T12 spear point. We now call it the B12. But 23 plus years later, that original design, that original line art, that sort of shadow box shape of the B of the T12 of the spear point is still <coughs> front and center in our collection and one of our best selling models. <coughs> so it's uh, every time, honestly, I'm a designer, right? So every time I do some new thing, I get really excited about it. And I love the process of creating and seeing it go from a pencil sketch to computer art to raw parts to finished parts to finished goods and um, that sort of manifestation of vision. <laughs> and I always think I've got something great. And hopefully it's always good, but not necessarily always great. And for whatever reason, um, the, the spear point folder just turned out to be great. And we have done many hundreds, if not possibly over a thousand different permutations of that knife over the years. Um, it started as a T10, or excuse me, a T12, was the code number for it, or our SKU number for it, and that was a liner lock with a titanium frame. And in around 2003, when I started making button locks and really fell in love with them, I took a look at my already at that point classic original patterns and in around 2005 I updated them including the T12 to the B for button 12 and adapted all of that geometry to be able to make a button lock and in the intervening years I've done a couple different handle styles and different inlay shapes but that blade shape that sort of big belly with that front finger grip sort of that choil where the handle transitions directly into the curvature of the blade to give you a really secure resting point for your front finger or for your thumb depending how you hold it um, that has been a hallmark uh, of William Henry all through these years and the design originally was inspired by when I was 19 I uh, had sort of an apprenticeship in a little knife shop on the coast of California and uh, we mostly that shop mostly made fixed blades sheath knives uh, kitchen knives handful of really interesting folders but uh, the the guy David Boy who owned the shop and was the designer did a lot of great utility knives that were relatively short and compact but with a really severe drop so that you had a really secure finger guard um, and I love the way that those extended from the hand and actually worked and so when I started designing William Henry I knew one of the first things I wanted to do was take that severe drop to the blade that gives you a finger guard and that deep belly and curvature um, and bring it into a folding knife. So uh, the T12, now the B12 was born and um, it continues to be really strong. I just love that, you know, with a, with, a, with a pocket knife, mostly what you're doing is carrying it, right? Occasionally using it, but mostly you're carrying it. So how big and heavy uh, the thing you have to carry is really important, hence my attention to making things as strong but also as light as possible. And with this geometry, it allows for enough blade to do anything you'd ever really want to do with a pocket knife, for sure, in a very comfortable and secure way. But that transitional sort of choil between the frame and the blade gives you a full, really full hand grip on it that's much more comfortable. So. I don't have to make the handle bigger because I've actually stretched the handle into the blade design a little bit without compromising the utility of the blade. So uh, that's a little nerdy and technical, I know, but this is what I do, what I live and breathe. And so uh, final note, we continue to make the B12s and we always have an extraordinary range, certainly true now. So if you go on to WilliamHenry.com, check out product, check out B12 spear point, you will see a whole extraordinary range of our latest offerings of this classic design. So thank you. We'll talk soon.